Hey guys, how's it going? I'm Kat, you know. Hello. Been a while, but not quite, you know, it's fine. So this video is gonna be a little different from the regular things I'd post. Not that any of my things really have a theme. It's just like I'm inspired by so many different YouTubers and they all have different kind of quirky things about them and I kind of just like so many different things for different reasons so I just feel like my content's all over the place. But you know, it's fine. This week's video was inspired by Savannah Brown and I'm gonna put Savannah's video in the description below so you can check that out. But yeah, I've just been really digging Savannah Brown's kind of vibe and I think she's a lovely human. I was just feeling inspired to do my own take of this so go check out her channel if you haven't before. Probably have because I'm nothing. Without further ado, before I ramble on, uh, here we go. I wish I could have a better sense of smell. I feel it's something a lot of people take for granted, and honestly, I think it'd just be nice to shop for perfume and soaps and candles for myself, but I just literally can't. I live in constant fear that I don't smell as great as I hope I do, even though I take the necessary precautions. The fact someone tells me something smells nice, while someone else can be clearly disgusted by the exact same smell, makes me really anxious. As I don't even know what my perfume smells like. And I didn't choose it. And I'm sorry if it offends you if you ever smell me. I just rely on others to help me pick out smells. So, I'm sorry. <laughs> I wish I was more interesting. And maybe do how, at the moment, my life is kind of stagnant because I'm in a gap year and all I really do is stay inside, play video games, and go on Tumblr. And most people stereotype that as relatable and funny, but in situations when you're telling people what you're doing with your life and that's what, all that's really happening and you're an adult, it's kind of frowned upon. It also makes small talk really difficult. Speaking of which, I wish I was better at small talk, but I honestly just find it really tedious. I'd much rather talk about existentialism or politics, but either A, most people can't have a rational discussion if I happen to have an opposing opinion, or B, it's just I can't bring up those types of conversation in small talk because that's extremely unconventional, so. I wish I was someone with a normal sleeping schedule because as quirky or fun as it sounds, going to bed at 3 or 4 in the morning and waking up at 9 or 10 in the morning I wake up every day just already feeling lazy and kind of like I'm failing myself. I wish I was better at makeup. Not for the sake of impressing anyone, but just purely for myself. And I feel self-conscious whether I wear makeup or I don't, mainly because I just started fairly recently and I feel like other girls my age have been doing it for years kind of just judge me. And I feel like that kind of contradicts my first statement about not wanting to be good just to impress other people, but you know. I wish I wasn't so focused on what others think of me. I wish I was better at goodbyes, but I don't know what the norm is. Like, do you want a high five? A, a hug? Uh, <laughs> handshake? I just didn't get the manual of how to do my farewells with other humans, so I'm sorry. I wish I was more sincere or genuine about my sentimental feelings. It's not that I don't feel them. It's just, I don't know how to convey my thoughts without making a joke of myself or being really self-deprecating. I wish I was more confident because I've had many instances of awkwardly hovering or <laughs> just kind of acting like I'm looking at other things when I'm in aisles and grocery stores for the main reason being someone is standing in front of the one thing I need from that aisle. But instead of just going up to them and confronting them, I just kind of hover because I don't want to interact with someone else. I'm just generally terrified in social situations. I wish I was better at speaking on the spot or in person with others because I have really intricate thoughts usually and I enjoy intellectual conversations. It's just I usually prefer to have those conversations over text so I can have my thoughts planned out and figure out how to articulate things correctly. I don't know. I wish I wasn't as shy as I am. Generally, that I have one friend around me, I'm fine, but if I'm alone, I struggle making new relationships, particularly because people scare me or I just scare myself. I wish I was better at playing musical instruments because I'm so indecisive. I wish I just tried to pick one and would have been good at that one instrument rather than trying to take on way too many and just being mediocre and not great at most of them. I wish I wasn't so indecisive. It literally hinders me in everything I do 
it's I think it's just a reason of my low confidence to, in myself to be honest but it's really prevalent in a lot of my actions like I think I bother my friends for constant reassurance on unnecessary things when I really just need to be happy with those things for myself and if I could accept those things for myself I wouldn't really need to pester my friends on what they think I should do but I'm just really indecisive so I try to have someone else make decisions for me and that's not really the best. I wish I'd stop becoming so attached to people that don't really care all that much about me. But yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna stop listing flaws now. <laughs> so I'm fine guys, like don't worry. I think this is gonna be not as positive, but you know, trying new things. New things, going new places, testing the waters, see what I want to make content wise. So you keep doing you. I'll see you guys soon and I hope you have a lovely day or time, or whatever you're doing. I believe in you. You are a small angel bean. You're gonna rule the world one day. Bye. <laughs>